If you want a build that can play lockdown and have an elite level of attributes and animations on the defensive end, while also being able to run point guard and dribble fast to get yourself open against other lockdowns, and of course shoot like Steph Curry from anywhere on the court, and I mean anywhere, then watch this video all the way through, drop a like, hit that subscribe button, and I'm going to get y'all right with this new three-way sharp build that has led me to a 96 win percent. So let's get into it. What is good, YouTube? It's your boy, Henry, aka Double H, back at it with yet another banger. And this is my new three-way sharp build. I'm going to show you how to make this build. I'm going to show you my record with this build. I'm going to be showing you what you should upgrade to the 85 overall with this build and what kind of badges and takeovers I have on this build right now. Now, look at this shot right here. Yes, I'm greening 82% contested greens. Slow it down, 82%. I've been playing competitive 3v3 crossplay Pro-Am, which honestly is like harder than stage these days because of how it works this year. Apparently, when you get 250 Pro-Am wins, you get permanent double reps. So every try hard is in here. And I've been going crazy. You can see the clips. We're showing some clips to start this video. Video, you see how this three-way sharp is moving i'm playing lockdown i'm guarding the guard on the other team and then i'm cooking the lockdown on the other team i am playing both primary positions on offense and defense with this build so this build can play defense on ball it can play offense as the point guard it can distribute to its teammates it can dribble to create space for itself to shoot it can shoot from anywhere and of course it can read lanes get chase down blocks and and play good defense overall and that's why i call it a three-way sharp now look at this clip right here i'm just gonna let this run through i showed this in my last video this was all in one clip bro literally it's two to two just let the clip roll i'll let y'all look at it in the background but yeah i know in basketball it's only a two-way you know defense offense i already know you're gonna comment that i'm just making up a random build name bro i know that okay but it can play make it can shoot and it can play defense okay this build does get a 25 driving dunk so if you're looking for an iso build that's gonna be dunking on people this is not the build i have a build like that on the channel it's called the five-way phenom build you can just look it up on youtube you'll find it but yeah I'm telling you, this three-way sharp is insane, bro. I've been going crazy with it. It's probably the build I'm going to be rep grinding with to get to top 10. Drop a like if I, if I should get the top 10. But yeah, we're going to show you how to make the build. Drop a like on the video right now. Make sure you're subscribed, okay? One million subscribers on the way. And look at this clip. I mean, it was just two to two. Now it's 17 to four. And then I chuck up a half-court shot and it just goes in dude i mean I, you can't make up this stuff bro this build's just too glitchy let's get into how to make it okay y'all so now it's time to make the three-way sharp build so we're gonna go into the builder and i'm gonna go over step by step why i did everything the way i did now just remember this build was made for me so if you want to make adjustments to it for how you play or who you play with or what game mode you play or what play style you have then go ahead and feel free to do that, okay? But obviously, we all know this builder is very strict, so you're going to have to make decisions on what you're going to sacrifice and what you're going to want on your build. Now, as you guys know, my ISO build is still the best ISO build in the game. This build is more for screens. If you're playing with the inside center, a little more for threes as well. It can play twos as well. I'm going to be playing twos with it a lot. Uh, but anyways, I'm going six foot six, okay? And we're going to go 180 pounds, which is minimum weight. Now, 6'6 six, six is the tallest height you can get gold speed booster at. And we're not going for strength on this build. So we may as well be as fast as possible. And unlike our other build, this build is actually going to completely max the acceleration. And we're going to have an 89 acceleration. Now, with the wingspan, we want to get silver limitless range, which is a 92 three-pointer. So I'm not going max wingspan or anything. I'm going to be going 6'8 wingspan. And that is the longest wingspan we can get while also allowing us to get a 92 three-pointer for that silver limitless range. And as you guys saw in my last gameplay video, and you're probably going to see in this video, this build has still tremendous defense even with this wingspan. So I kind of even forgot that the wingspan was this low. I'm not going to lie to you. But anyways, let's go ahead and continue and start with the finishing. So with the finishing, this is what we're sacrificing on this build. This build's not going to be a good finisher. It's not going to be dunking the ball. It's going to be playing with a lot of inside centers. It's going to be playing threes. It's going to be a guard ball, but it's not going to be able to get contact dunks or anything like that. So we're going 25 driving dunk, okay? We'll have a 72 layup though, which is going to give us some good, uh, you know, layup badges like, you know, silver scooper, gold pro touch, silver float game 
you know, even like bronze slithery bronze acrobite silver giant and slayer which is you know it's it'll get the job done right well even we're even gonna get uh you know bronze uh fearless finisher when we upgrade our other stuff but let's go ahead and keep going and we'll show all the badges at the end while when we're done upgrading anyways let's start with the shooting which is you know a big reason why this build i like to call it the three-way sharp is because it shoots over people it shoots from crazy deep and that's why we're getting a 92 three-pointer for the silver limitless range we're also going at 84 mid-range for the gold mini magician you can fade mid-ranges like crazy on this build and yeah if you want to upgrade the free throw on this build go ahead and do so i'm not going to be upgrading the free throw because number one 67 is way more than good enough for me if i put on the michael jordan free throw and number two i'm not going to be playing a crazy amount of fives with this build even though i think this is actually going to be my 5 5 prom build i'll probably play wreck with it too but anyways regardless 67 free throws more than enough for me now we're going to go with a 70 pass accuracy because if i do play fives with this build it's not going to play the one it's going to play the two and on the threes and the twos y'all saw in the gameplay the 70 pass accuracy was more than good enough for me now if you aren't confident in that then you can go higher ball handle i'm going 92 i wanted to try to go 93 for that hall of fame ankle burger but we went with 92 because 93 was just too expensive this is going to give us gold unpluckable it's going to help us get handles for days it's going to give us gold speed booster we're going to go with an 83 speed ball which is also going to help us get that gold speed booster now with the defense okay i'm not going to upgrade the defense yet we're going to save that for last so let's go ahead and move on to the vitals because i want to show you guys how cheap some of these defensive stats are and why i upgraded them because i know a lot of you guys are going to question that anyways let's move on to the vitals so we're gonna go 80 speed 89 acceleration which is going to be a max acceleration now i did want to go 82 speed for that gold hyperdrive but it was just too expensive we were getting other attributes that were just worth more so with the 80 speed which is fine because that's what my other build has but 89 acceleration this is going to be my fastest build when it comes to acceleration now strength we went with a 55 so we can get a couple badges that we're going to unlock like bronze for this finisher and silver clamps for defense that's the strength we need we went with a 60 vertical so we can get bronze chase on artists because we're also going to be getting that and then we went with a 96 stamina so we can get that gold handles for days it's going to help us get 94 feet and workhorse as well now going on to the defense right the first thing we're going to go ahead and do is get a 93 perimeter defense that gives us gold fast feet gold challenger gold clamps gold workhorse gold 94 bro i'm telling you this build's defense is literally insane and that this perimeter defense definitely makes up for that wingspan for sure now steel 85 i feel like this is the money spot for any build 85 steel is so good you saw me ripping a bunch of people we get silver rights to grip but i don't even use it bro the silver glove is good enough now look at this build it is at a 97 overall okay we only have two overalls left. You're probably thinking, oh, the defense ain't looking too good. Look at this, bro. We're going to go ahead and put the block to a 68, which is going to give us bronze chase down. And then we're going to put the interior defense to a 69 and boom, we're 99 overall. Look at how cheap the block and interior defense stats were. The defense is insane. The only thing you can complain about the defense is the rebounding, but I'm already 6'6". I'm going to be getting rebounds over the small guards because they're not going to be upgrading the rebound anyways. Other than that, I'm going after long rebounds with gold workhorse. So I don't need a rebound on this build. Once again, if you want to upgrade the pass accuracy, you can do that. If you want to upgrade the free throw, you could do that. Yes, this build's weakness is a driving dunk. That's what we're sacrificing to get a literally 92 three-pointer, 92 ball handle, and 93 perimeter defense. That's why it's called the three-way sharp. And I know in basketball, it's only two ways. I know, bro. I've played varsity basketball in high school. I know that. It's just a fun build name to give it, you know, because it can do three different things at an elite level, perimeter defense, ball handle and three pointer but anyways anyways look at the badges right here i mean this is insane silver agent three is gold blinders gold blow by gold clamps gold dead eye gold handles for days silver gloves silver limitless silver interceptor silver killer combos gold unpluckable gold speed booster hall of fame comeback kid hall of fame claymore gold open looks gold mini magician gold guard up this build is looking insane hall of fame off ball pest bronze chase down artist gold spin cycle gold slippery off ball gold big big dodger gold ankle breaker gold green machine gold challenger gold 94 feet dude gold space i mean it just keeps going it just keeps going this build's badges are ridiculous anyways let's go ahead and move on look at the build name we actually get shades of kirk heinrich drew holiday and cj mccall which is kind of interesting kirk heinrich was literally like that role player for the bulls who was just a crazy good three-point shooter and a defender and that's what this build really is drew holiday for that defense as well and cj mccall for that shot making as well two-way three-point shot hunter what i like to call my three-way sharp build 
This build's insane, y'all. So now it's time to look at a couple things here about if you just made this build and want to upgrade it to an 85, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. I'm also going to show the bed is that I have on the build right now. Now, currently, I have it at a 94, 95 overall. And since recording this, I also have a higher win percent with it. I have a 96 win percent now, but you're going to see my record in a second. It's a 95 win percent. So here are my stats at a 94 overall. Now, if you were upgrading to an 85, obviously, you're not going to get all this stuff but what I, what I would do is just max the three max the mid range get the perimeter defense to an 87 steal 85 and then get up your ball handle and your speed with ball as high as possible and max your 70 pass accuracy and then max your acceleration speed and and uh stamina and that should be good enough you know you're probably not gonna have any strength vertical you're not gonna have your max perimeter defense and you're not gonna have any finishing or rebounding or free throw upgraded but that's what i did to start at 85 overall the main things you want to do when upgrading to 85 regardless of what you choose make sure you do have that pass accuracy make sure you at least get an 85 ball handle for some dribble moves get at least an 83 speed ball to work for that gold speed booster and obviously max your shooting like this build is a sharpshooter it's a very good shooter max the midi max the three-pointer of course you want your vitals your stamina and stuff to be maxed as well okay and then you can work on the defense now here's the bad is i got on it right now honestly i've made a lot of progress on this build in a short amount of time it's a very good build to get bad on. we have gold open looks triple strike you know mini magician we got some other bronze badges here this is what we rock with gold catch and shoot gold fast speed already we already have silver challenger we have gold handles for days gold dead eye gold speed booster gold unpluggable silver limitless silver agent three silver blinders i mean we're going crazy with this build i almost have it completely maxed in some of these categories obviously we don't have a 99 overall yet so we don't get all the badges right now but we're making some good progress so yeah make sure when you are grinding this build out you know get into the my crew maybe get into some of the like street ball games and shoot over like the five seven dudes and get your badges i also put my gold, gold floor setter on unpluckable and my silver on killer combos honestly i should put my silver on right stick ripper though anyways here is my record as well uh prime teams undefeated and my park record which is actually already better than this i'm like 290 and 13 now so we have like a 96 win percent we're going crazy with this build y'all we are going crazy not only that we have a bunch of takeover perks i have unlocked all of them i have accelerators sponge i would recommend using sponge or accelerator on this build especially since you're gonna be a guard in a lockdown maybe saboteur if you want to really go lockdown mode but anyways y'all it's been your boy henry aka double h make sure to drop a like on this video click on the one of the videos on your screen if you want an iso build we have that if you want the jump shot we have that if you want my dribbles we have that on the channel go check it out subscribe to the channel it's been your boy henry and I'm out, y'all. Peace.